making, or lack thereof, Larry had to make when recovering. He yeah. couldn't get back on at all. He was forced to roll in, There's, and as soon as he did, yeah. forward tilt or forward smash. Smash, yeah. He's like, get him out of here, and he was done <laughs> every single time. Dom, so. Dom thinks about the character in such a fashion that even the little intricate things with things like cross, he'll know what to do in those situations. If you think if you think you know Dom when he throws projectiles, you don't know Dom until you find yourself at the corner thinking spot dodge was the best option. Before we go into this match here, uh, Hungry Box, I yeah. want to give a good shout out to my friend, somebody who's helped you out here. Last, if you're out here, if Yo, you're watching the stream last, I miss you. I promise you will be here one day. And with that being said, let's get into this tale here of T3 Dom versus Elegant in Last, game one. The Karate Master. They're going to go to Battlefield on game one. And Elegant already showing not too much fear. He knew he was going to get into his face really close quarters. That's the problem with Battlefield. These platforms sort of make you interact very close to your opponent. But Dom and Richter, they kind of want some space. Let, yeah. the, let the, all the projectiles do the work that they need to do. Nice little up B there. Try to, try to get a, a holy water there. The thing here for Dom is even when he throws any projectile, he uses another to cover it up Ooh. and then force a situation like that. He has that holy water, so if he tries to come back from a high recovery, that water will cover that platform and give him safe passage. Right, there's nothing else he's doing. But look at this, now he has to, he has to act. Yeah. Smart to roll in though. Up B again, not gonna die, gonna live. Elegant's gonna come back down with a fireball to mitigate the one of the cross. The beautiful thing here about Dom is that even when he misses his projectiles, Ooh. he knows what to go for. Such a deep end, but Elegant comes back. Holy crap, that was so smart. That was the perfect angle to actually come in. I do like that Elegant evaluates the better situation at times. Do I want to die at this edge trap, or would I rather take a smaller hit when I get back onto the stage? That's quick decision making. The combo assist from the cross, yep. forward throw, no kill here. Dom holds all the cards and the stage here for the ledge guard. And the rules always stay alive as long as you can. I don't care if it's 176, 188, but in that case, Nice forward tilt. It was voted, I think, as one of the top five, or potentially the best forward tilt in the game, actually. Yeah, was such range. Incredibly good. As good as the smash attack in some of the cases. Went for a kind of a cheesy up B there. I respect like the attempt right there. Might have gone for another one, too. Mm -hmm. Waits for the shield. No <laughs> movement at all. That is patience indeed here for Elegant. He knows what he has to look for. He's got Ooh. Dom at 99, but Dom knows I have to keep this quick okay. team Elegant What's on the ground. Okay, a little forward, a little, little love tap. Dash tag, look, it covers behind him too. It's good too because it can't cross up on the shield here. And at worst, Dom will eat a grab punish. Yep, and then and then Elegant tries to leave out the Zare hitbox. Oh, not gonna do him well. Up B might have actually been a lot of danger for him. Back here to follow the platform. Down B still alive for Dom, who has full rage now. And he clutches onto the ledge oh. with a super well timed tether. And that cross there to cover him in case Elegant tries to go for that grab. Oh my. Good patience, yeah. Oh. Excellent, excellent. He held that trigger so well because he knows this is a small punish I have to go for. I cannot immediately go for anything otherwise. It's like your shit is useless. Elegant shaking his head in frustration right now. And that's going to be potentially a three stock lead. One more axe throw, one more read of anything. Actually, Holy Water going straight to the garbage there. Okay. Dom on the miss, whiff grab here, but I like that change up. Gets that cross up, or tilt, Elegant yep. off the stage. I love that because Dom is looking to force Elegant to go for that low recovery or a high jump there, and you see it come out. Very, very good. He's still alive. That's the one thing Elegant had. Air dodge to keep him alive. He's going to recover with the tether. He does. Tries to wait out for a nair read. Dom B's finally going to do it. Yeah. Now Elegant needs a, a, the cheesiest kill in the world right here to have any chance. Oh, this is this is one of the things that Elegant stocks are made of, right? Yeah. That one grab to change everything here, but Elegant has to hunt down for it. And you know Dom will not make that easy for him. Yeah, he needs a negative one to death, not a zero to death. He needs this Ooh. to be just a finisher from yesterday, baby. And look at this, 76 unanswered. Up B whiffed, Elegant full rage, backer to answer. Can he get the kill? He does, wait, no, 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 one more time. Look, I like that, he waits oh for it, he waits for it, he waits for And the misfire, <laughs> the pickle on the ledge, he comes back. Elegant with the lead out of nowhere. He waited for that one and it pays off, man. Patience is a virtue, that up be from Dom. 173, Elegant still surviving here. He knows what this is gonna go down to. Okay, one more time. Look at this, how much can he hold the stock now? 173, can he get anything off this? Maybe 10%, maybe one grab. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's... Yeah. That's good too because the way that that ax works, just to see how Elegant goes below from the stage. Elegant was in the shadow realm yeah. and it still killed him <laughs> the, vertically. That's how strong that ax is at 203. Dead even game here. There's a big grab, which could have said a lot. Up there, but no backer continue. Dom wiping the sweat of his brow mentally at this point. Knows that could have been really, really bad. Instead, he has back to neutral action here. Gonna play the first stock like it is last stock. All right. 
Dom knows what he's got to hold on here. Center stage, Elegant sees that opportunity for a grab. Oh, Only up there. Good mix up, yeah. There's a Zare into a real grab. Oh. And Elegant out of nowhere with the clutch. Dom had to lead the whole game there. Yes. And the thing here is that this is what I've seen here at WNF. The story goes that every single time these two play, it could be a game five scenario or a 3 0. But for Elegant, I'm telling you, man. That's what an elegant stock is made out of. It is that last minute clutch or kick situation. Elegant will always find that clutch. And do, do, you, do you see that like six foot four, 17 year old watching in the middle of the car in the gray shirt? <laughs> I just learned today that's Kiraz. Yes. He's bigger than I am. <laughs> guy's giant. He, he's he is watching. Tall. Yeah, he, he is tall. Wants, he he's, wants he's taking the, those notes. He told me he wants the money match elegant. He wants to get on this setup right after money matches. And he wanted me to stream it, but I said, bro, I can do top eight. He's not for blood. He's watching. He's watching his enemies close. I mean, let me tell you. Yeah, you know what they say, man. Keep your friends close, your enemy closer. And I think that's what we see from Kira sitting there. And keep those Zares really close, because my god. Luigi does not mess around here. Shield at there and a parry up B answer. Now we're in town and city. Like I said, Dom wants a lot more room. Look at this. Mm -hmm. He can dance on the middle platform, throw out forward airs, have no risk at all in doing so. And every time Elgin tries to approach, he just takes another turn. So he's going to take every little bit he wants. That big room he'll have in this stage is going to be also really good in initially to run away from Luigi if we do see Elegant on that aggressive part. The thing about Elegant is he will always remain aggressive. So that's good for Dom to understand the stage pick here. So far, Dom leaves the charge, stage control in his hands. He sees that low recovery. Never forget, Axe will go under that stage if it has the ability there at the ledge. Okay. Dash tag a little bit greedy, but no answer from Dom. Mm -hmm. And I respect that too. He looks to go back to center stage, throw out whip, and then wait to see how Elegant is going to respond to him taking center stage. Dom knows where he has to hold the cards. I got to say, of all of Luigi's most recent buffs, the dash tag is the one I see the most often. <laughs> I don't know why. I see him go for it more often than ever. It's pretty useful. Oh, yeah, that forward. Yep. It will do it. That forward, just the chop. Just the you, chop. You, you let gravity do the work, mm -hmm. right? Elegant knows that better than anyone. Okay. Edge guard attempt here. Missing just barely everything. The axe is going to connect, but not going to kill at 147. But that yes. fair, going to put him in one last tricky spot. Down beat a delay. Yeah, too, a little, little too low there. Mm -hmm. I do like the inherent pressure Dom looks to see how Elegant might react when he tries to come back on the stage, right? Do I want to set up cross here? Is this an opportunity for me to go for another angle forward air? That's what Dom looks to see when Elegant comes back. He knows some of Elegant's tricks, and he's not afraid to try to punish them at the very last second here. Can we take a second to appreciate how incredible the recovery has been from both players so far? Oh, yeah. It, I mean, absolutely phenomenal. Top, top in this matchup I've, I've ever seen. For, for Dom, he's so smart when he goes for that directional air dodge right from the farthest side because he knows I have to execute this now yep. to have the most momentum to get to the stage as soon, as soon as possible. And Kirash holds the green rocket for as long as he can off every recovery. Now Dom, about 60% lead here, gonna let Elgin come to him. Oh, Perry, but no to answer. Down air, again, dash attack. Now they're, whiff now they're whiffing moves that I hit before. They're both understanding what move they both rely on, their comfort moves. Now I gotta mix it up a little bit. There it is, take this, cross, get off the ledge. Invincibility, windling down, back air mm -hmm. tipper, God! And the way that, one thing you have to remember about cross too, it does have a position where it'll actually spin in place and still stay as an active hitbox. Dom actually timed that there towards the ledge, so if Elegant wanted to spot dodge normal get up, that was so much pressure in place. And now Elegant, a stock down, needs to answer with maybe a little maybe a little projectile play of his own. Put some fireballs in there, make Dom second guess his actions. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, it's going to be a little too late. 12% already. Uh, good cross up there from Elegant, unfortunately, from the dash attack. But I like that. Dom knows where he has to trade in terms of positioning. It's tempting to punish Luigi, but you have to look at your positioning. Back air from Elegant here. That sends Dom off the stage. He sends the cross away. Now Elegant was forced to interact with it, going for a short hop down air. I gave Dom dash some time. Dash attack of his own right there. Platform getting involved. The nudge dash attack. It has so much vertical coverage. More than I think so. Okay, oh. Zare, that mm. might kill actually. It yeah. does. Elegant again, similar situation to last game. About down 50, but it took one good combo to finish it off. Yeah, and Dom is aware of that. That's, that's the one thing I have to appreciate about Dom in this matchup. He knows what how important it is. If Elegant gets a cross up, something on whip, it is better oh, to take control man. of the stage itself. Dom with Whoa! that. Whoa! <laughs> Ping pong combo to himself. He is literally playing this man like a pinball machine, and he is not afraid Bro, to execute. He is doing Armada Android combos with one controller. That's <laughs> impressive. That's actually phenomenal. Amazing stuff by Dom. Man, mm -hmm. this guy really has the sauce, huh? This this is one of the few players that I had the very pleasure of sitting in a carpool on the way to Evo, watching him use the switch 
on, on, on it the way it was meant to be used, playing all the way from four hours from SoCal. Uh, on Joy-Cons? Uh, jo no, not on Joy-Cons. He had it standing there on the car seat with his pro controller, with his buddy next to him on the way to Evo. This man is a monk. Yeah. He, he, he's a monk from four the mountains. Four hours, man. From he did the not, mountains. Yeah, he did not stop playing on that entire car ride. Good Lord. One to one. The way winner's finals should be, it should go back and forth. Mm -hmm. Nothing's Nothing less hype than a 3-0 winner's finals. These are the two best players in the building from the bracket. Let's see a show right here. To game three, Elegant's counter pick will be Pokemon Stadium, giving Dom a little less room, no top platform to resort to, and giving Elegant just a few more chances now to get these grabs on the platform. All right, so far, Dom taking control here of the center stage. He knows I gotta stop Elegant from coming back in. Goodness. There is that forward tilt. He's got Goodness. all the projectiles Don't there. do it. Don't! Oh my God! I got so scared for Elgin there. No, he was looking. He was looking to play right into Dom's hands. Four throw. That's grab. oh, oh one mash out. Yeah. Beautiful mash. Now Dom is still at zero. That's Luigi's favorite percent for a grab. As far as I'm concerned, this is still, <laughs> this is still even. Oh! oh! What do you do there? Dom did not like the, the Dom did not. Dom hurt you. Dom hurt you. What do you do there? <laughs> you, you declare bankruptcy. There's nothing. <laughs> you have one option. It's to go down. And this He's, is. Dom, no way he planned that. For Elegant, man, oh, he's no. looking for that grab. No, no, it's no, gonna no. be that stimulus check. Dom, you're a Okay, I'm about to say. Elegant needs his zero death or it's over. That is the stimulus check? And that's called. The oh, oh, did not cash it. Did not cash it. Was not able to get it, but. Oh, no! Oh, oh no! Elegant saying, boy, I'm still in this. That's Zara at the very last problem at that ledge. He had the trick up his sleeve. All righty, my God. They, they, no matter how much he's down, Elegant finds a way back up. That's why it's so sick. Now, fair. Again, he's still at zero. So many times. I like that. Dom looking to lead Elegant in with one of these projectiles. He knows once I get one of these hits, I can't confirm to something like up air, Ooh. like so, and Ooh. I will punish him for it. <laughs> you have to double the triple. Can he finish it off? He oh. <laughs> This man's a sniper. He's a sniper oh, that is a small with time. a 15 pound axe. <laughs> My God. God. Now a full stock lead for Dom. All right. Dom's got a full lead here. Elegant looking for that. Oh, once, again, once again, it is a clutch or kick situation for Elegant. Okay. And he is looking right, to clutch. One, two, three, four, five. Oh. Okay. No sayonara. Nice. I like that. He follows him up for a small punish that is the upper. Even if it doesn't do much, he's looking for the percent. Elegant knows what he has to hunt for. It's, it's a full stock lead. I'm not going to say it's, it's, it's over yet. Elegant brought us back game one in this exact situation. I like that. He, the way that Elegant is slowly moving out of that ledge, he is looking to either stall his descent or stall his landing. And right there, he was looking for a nair out of the jump, but Dom had the nair from the full hop to answer. I mean, it seems he's once up ahead this whole time this game. Mm -hmm. Okay, I like, I'm like. i thinking he should more fireballs. And, the, and the, thing, the thing here for Dom is he always wants Ooh. to not only stay one step ahead, he wants to stay one Ooh. six feet away. As far as you can from Elegant, he wants a social distance. Nair, back air. Yep. It will do it. All right, everyone hold. The winner of this match, I think, wins the set. <laughs> and it might, might be the possibility here. Elegant is looking for that one slipper from Dom, that one back air, this that one forward air. This is a binary decision. Does <laughs> Elegant hit this grab or not? Okay, greedy axe throw, but he's on the platform. And that up, he's going to do it. Mm. We're going to game four. With Good his, stuff from with Dom. JV2 from Dom. This guy, some of the cleanest Richter play I have ever seen. I mean, and, I, and I like that too because he sees Elegant's movement. He sees how Elegant tries to move not only around him from the ledge, around him on the stage. He sees that aerial attempt. He, he knows Elegant's going to do what? A nair, an up air, or a tornado to get him here. I'm going to execute this down air. Let me get this up B. And let me put that game four on my side. That's the beautiful thing about Dom. He looks at his opponent's habits, but he looks at what cards are on the table every single time. And that is all you need. Now, is he going to run back to PS2? I like that he did it. I like if he gets, mm -hmm. if he loses kind of badly, try a different stage. And it's, it's FD, it's flat. Yeah. As many grabs as you want here. I like that. Elegant starts off a little bit different here. He looks to use that spacing in terms of fireballs, but he looks to use the whole stage. Tough spot for Elegant, though. He was caught in that holy water, and he's able to take back center stage. Okay. okay. No punish on the landing here, but I do like that Elegant patiently waits to see how Dom is going to react as well. Put the nair on the shield, too, to kind of little it down. Down B as, a, as an aerial, right? Mm -hmm. I think you need that more often because it's multiple hits. Multi hits in, the, in ultimate, always the best moves. Like that nair, his down B. Now, Luigi is a Shoto, don't forget. <laughs> as you can see. Very, very clearly. And now he's going to throw 
Nice. Oh! Off the deep end. Off the I deep like end. That. Just a small chop. I love that. And it's so it's so weak right there, mm -hmm. but it doesn't matter how weak. The fact that it has any you know knockback at all is the important part. That's the risk reward factor here for Richter, too. He's got that great tether, but the problem is you're too low. Elegant has multiple ways to punish that low recovery. And Elegant loves it when you recover low. Oh, he does. Oh! <laughs> that almost killed. That's what I love about Dom and his projectiles, man. Every time he sees a pick, he moves in for the kill. He knows what it's worth. Trading aerials now. That down B is getting him a lot of mileage. Gonna see a lot more of those in game five if it comes to it. Nice, good roll there to little get a little bit close. And then Can he get an another soft chop? Oh, he gets it. That's a stock. soft chop indeed here, and that's 3-1. Oh, all right. Beautifully played by Elegant. He understood what was going wrong game four. Mm -hmm. Didn't crack, held it together. Now it's dominating Dom on game four. Nice, I like that. He goes for that empty hop here. He can hit him with an angle forward air. And not only that, he's looking to get the cross to move around as well. Dom understands how his projectiles work. Okay, down be a little bit canceled there. Now you see a little oh, bit this of nerves. Is for oh, skadoosh, down smack, why not? Grabs the holy water, throws it down, gives himself a little bit of leeway. Okay, Elegant looking to slowly move himself right back in the dump. I like that. That's what he's looking for. He's looking for Dom to catch Dom on the starting oh, frame from So smart. He actually grabs the fire, the water mid-air, throws it down, makes his own oh. ledge trap. No! Okay, now he's now he's he's getting inside a little bit. He's playing with his food just a little bit. He's he's got time to spare. Nice, what a change it from Elegant too. Going for the forward air, trying to mix up on the DI on Dom, see how he might get away. See what happens. Up smash. Mm, yep, and that'll and do it here. Game five situation, winners finals. Ladies and gentlemen, the way it should be, only one can enter grand. The question is, where will Richter, where will Dom rather take Elegant for the game five? That's, the, that's, that's the big question here. This is usually the situation we saw, like I said. WNF, every Wednesday, these two are playing, yes. It, it goes any direction here, but we're going back to town and city. Oh, wait, wait. Didn't he already win on town? So we do not use DSF. So he can definitely go back to town and say, that is the crazy stuff here for us here in SoCal. <laughs> Come again? No DSF. No DSR, I'm so sorry. That is my bad. That is my terrible. I'm thinking, okay. So we do have a player by the name of DSF. Legendary, by the way, but we're talking about DSR. That is Dave's stupid role here, and that does allow Dom to come back here to town and city. You know what? I was playing hugs and beer pong last night. He came in with the, the, the dumbest SoCal rule set, and I couldn't believe it. <laughs> now, I'm not okay. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> I'm just saying, DSR exists for never mind. Okay, we're back on town and city. <laughs> we're back on town and city. I'm not, I'm not gonna talk about it. I'm not gonna talk about it. Down air, Nair up to whoa, big combo from Elegant. Oh my god, the spacing on that Zare. He almost got a hit. Mm -hmm. It was so close. This is this is literally what's what, what puts Dom all to his full potential. He knows I have to maintain the distance between Elegant, but I love the fact that Elegant always looks at some of the weaknesses that Richter has. The starting frame, oh. the ability to just get up close and personal with Richter. He has very little option no, here. He literally I'm, I'm I'm convinced you can't do anything there. <laughs> I'm convinced if you if he throws the holy water at the right spot and you no matter if you roll, if you jump. If you dodge, you're, you're dead either way. It's a, it's a nail in the coffin, no matter what mm -hmm. you do. You choose your own death. Ooh, what a good way to try to cover the roll there from Dom. He missed that angle forward air, but it was still a great attempt. It's like well, yeah, now, we, now we're seeing that. Every time, there's, the reason why we're here on Town and City is Dom will go for those retreating aerials. You can see that because he wants to stop Elegant from getting any closer. He accepts the pressure, but he punishes it with his own. It's just so much to deal with at once. Oh. Luigi okay. is just a humble plumber. He didn't sign up for any of this. Maybe kill some ghosts, you know? A little bit of that. Maybe right, get, right, really so, you maybe know. get overshadowed by his older brother, but not for this. Not to deal with, the, with, with home alone furniture being thrown at you every second of a match for 10 minutes straight. It's just so much. There's only so much the plumber can actually take here, but what a great way to actually punish that because you can punish, he can punish roll, he can punish get up, he can punish jump, Elegant looked for all those situations here, and he saw that tornado was the best one. All right, great. Up here, that is the quick get off me option. That's probably the only one that the Belmonts have. 126. Elegant needs an answer. I think throw a fireball, make him just double guess himself. Oh my oh. god. And this is set point for Dom, who just two weeks ago won MSM for many of the first times the pandemic was over. Four hits! 
big combo from Elegant to 82. Oh, How much further? Oh my god. 85. Big answer though. Oh, oh Dom. 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 Dom, stop it. Oh no. Oh no. This is the pinball machine. This Look is the this. pinball machine. I, I hear the arcade machines of the sounds already. That's tech. Oh, oh, no, okay, no. okay. Okay, well. that was the fourth auto connect combo he did. <laughs> no, he's in the future. He is, he is, no, he is. No, no, no way! I can't no. believe it. Jesus, Dom! Alright. This is this the best Richter in the world? Is this the best Richter in the world?